Yeah, we left there early. We ran into pretty bad storms coming in, but she shipped really good, didn't seem to bother her, and she's been eating up good since she's here. Went to the track to, this morning, trained very nice, and uh, hopefully everything stays good up until the day of the race. At least we're here a few days, you know, to let her get a feel of the track and go from there. I don't know exactly who we're running against yet, but wait and see. Yeah, she looked great out there galloping this morning. Was that a, what you were hoping to see? Yes, yeah. She's a little bit, a little bit uh, more aggressive this morning because of a couple of days of walking. She she worked uh, Wednesday morning at Tampa, and, we, and then we left the following morning. And then talk about her her races so far. I haven't seen her PPs, but I know she's a real nice filly. Talk about her her, her biggest win so far, and uh, when did you know that you had something special? Well, actually, I I knew you know we have a very nice filly when before we even ran her in uh, in her maiden race at uh, Delaware. She just won it's so easy in hand, and she'd been training really good up to that race. And then we went to uh, down to Calder and. She beat some horses that had, you know, a lot more experience than her than she had. She only had a couple of races. One was in the mud. Her second race kind of got down in on the rail and deep going. This we might have run her back a little bit quick off of a strong maiden win. But she's been getting better and better and stronger, more mature, finishing growing up, and uh, hopefully everything stays good and, and we end up very competitive in the race. Who's your rider going to be in the race, and uh, what kind of a trip are you hoping for in the Miss Preakness? Uh, Edwin Gonzalez is going to ride her, the same rider. We just figured to keep her with the same connections. And uh, she can, she's tactical. She can kind of lay right there. Depends on how the race breaks. She breaks, you know, pretty sharp, and then he can use his own judgment how it is. And if she breaks clear, well, you just kind of do your own thing. Just let, let the race unfold in front of you, you know, and then go from there. She's competitive to to want to win, so uh, hopefully everything goes good. And I, I know you've won, uh, I think, o over 3,600 races in your career, correct? Yeah. And uh, so uh, have you been to Pimlico before here, and have you been here on uh, a Preakness weekend? No, it's my first time here, just watch it on television. And uh, first time here and see, you know, how we do with the track. And been watching races here, all your major race for, you know, a lot of years since I was 18, so <laughs> to be new, something new. I've traveled all over everywhere except California, but this is the first time at this track. Hopefully this turns out good. <laughs>